Hey guys. So if you haven't been on social media or haven't seen the news recently, um, there's one thing I gotta say. Clown. Yup, you heard me. Since it's October, there's a huge like epidemic of like clown scaring and clown sightings. Cause it's all like just big one big prank. People just want to see the reactions of like, you know, scaring other people and such. I don't even know how this became viral at all. Oh my god. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here. Oh! <laughs> At the beginning of October, it's all fine and dandy, and then boom! I don't know where clown sightings and everything shows up. It's all over Twitter, it's all over Instagram, it's all over the freaking news. It's everywhere, like I said before. I gotta say something to you guys. I'm not afraid of clowns, but if I'm driving by and it's late at night and I see one of this. <laughs> 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 There's two options for me to do. The first option is driving by all the way back to where I was and saying, Hell to the no, to the no, 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 hell no, no, to the no, no. And now the second time is just I want to run that motherfucker out of here. Oh He's running right after this. Hit it. Hit that bitch. Oh Hit that. <laughs> Even the other day ago, seriously not kidding, or there was something, it wasn't at my school, it was like at a middle school where I was, where there was a legit lockdown at their school because there was a clown in the daytime. Now for today's video, I'm going to tell you how you can survive a clown attack or like clown sighting if ever a clown has gone out to you and tried to scare you or try to kill you or something with a knife. I have some of these methods where you can just escape easily and just walk away freely or, or, or they can go the other way around and just screw up the clown. Have you ever heard of that old Nickelodeon TV show, um, Ned Disclassified? Discuss Ned Disclassified. You know, I can't even say it right, but you know what I'm talking about? I'm basically gonna do that right now. So here we go, Juan Disclassified on surviving clown sightings. Woo! Fuck that clown! Fuck that clown! Fuck that clown! All right, first up, you know how like a lot of like sightings you see from like Twitter or Instagram or any of those? You may notice that most of them are wearing either makeup or a mask. Most of them are wearing a mask. Now, if you ever seen a clown, all you just gotta do is bring up your handy dandy, handy dandy mask or something and just be like, hey, you know, I'm, I'm with you guys, I'm part of the squad, I'm part of the clown scaring squad, here we go, turn up boy. Now, since I'm poor and I don't have like a legit mask, I just printed it off like on the internet, so here we go, I got myself my mask here, all you just gotta do is add some tape and you're all fine to go. Marafaha! So now I already have applied my mask. It doesn't look as great, but you know, it's better than nothing. It's better than getting stabbed, right? It's better than getting chased down. Like pretty, pretty, pretty cute. Don't I? Hashtag no filter, am I right guys? All right, I gotta take this off. Oh! Ah, I'm such a wuss. Now for method two, there's two parts. The first part, if you ever have your car ready. I, I question the people who have their car and recording the people, but they always drive the other way, running away from the clown. Even though their car, your car, literally your car is like maybe twice as big as that person. Maybe even three times if you have those monster trucks. You don't go backwards. You go forward. You gotta charge him at him while he's running to you and be like, Phenomenia! <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Hit him. He's down. That's what he gets for pretending to be a clown. Now for the second part, if you don't have your car, walking through the nighttime, because that's how genius you are, and you just meet up a clown. Hey, okay. Now this one, you should either run away. I'm highly suggesting you, you should fight him. As long as he has like a knife or a gun or something, you should be running away. But if he doesn't have any of those items or something sharp, you just square at him. Square up. TJ, I'm about to run, TJ. <laughs> TJ, seriously? TJ, come on. We need to go. TJ, get off of him! We're all star a freaking cloud. Now for method three, this is 100% satisfactory, all right? This is like 100% working method. Just stay inside. Just wait until this like horror trend or scaring prank is now over two more weeks or maybe even a week and then you're gonna be set out free and then everything's all good. But yeah, that's pretty much it guys. I just wanted to make this short video so you guys can at least survive when there's either a clown sighting, if a clown tries to attack you, or if you've ever seen a clown at all during this whole like scary month or something, this, this, these are your methods, all right? That is pretty much it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Leave a like and subscribe, and don't forget to share the video if you enjoyed it. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I gotta go, the one and only, signing out. Peace.